welcome again in previous tutorial we have seen how to create this sidebar and when we clicked in in title we are able to see post details in view base so now it is very simple so now oh, here we have some contents list same thing in here but in this time there is a title and uh, uh, article details uh, so we have to at first we have to create this linkable when we will click in here it should go in blocks view so it's very simple we go in here and you can see it's actually wrapped by a anchor tag so i'm just changing the href to this url build and this build in this build i am sending controller name controller will be box controller and our action will be view and then i'm sending the id i'll just copy this line and paste it in here and this id so now when after save if you go and reload our page and then go in here just reload our page and then when you click in here you will now able to see the content details so this view actually we have created in previous tutorial what we have did uh, we just create a view function and pass the id as a parameter this id received here and then it's actually fetch the article according to the, this id and this set to articles and after this set we have just uh, in, we have just fetch it in view.php so in this tutorial the main topics will be how we can create read more option for example here we are actually seeing the full article but we actually want it in three line or two line article when you click it here then we should see the full article so for that cacphp has provided a text helper and text helper has a truncate method we are just we will just use this truncate method for make this uh, small or make this reduce this uh, article so i'm just copy this line and just paste it in here this is my details we will re reduce these details and in here i'm pasting it and just going to use here the php tag like this because we will not use the echo in here and then i'm just replacing this uh, line to this line that means our article details lines so here to here i'm just removing and then comma and here you can see the 22 characters 22 characters so we'll see at least 280 characters 280 characters and ellipsis means uh, it will after finish the art uh, line it will see a dot 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 and then here you can see the exact false exact false and uh, when you will see the output it will be look like this so you can see the word uh, when you in here the word has finished then it given these three dots but if you made this exact true then it will not uh, wait for the send uh, uh, send uh, 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 word you can see the translate in this time it is giving sh sure and then there uh, but when you will keep this false then just see in here this sure and this th here when you really re replace you can see the sure that means it will see your complete word uh, it will not break your word so when you will give this uh, true it is true then it will see you exact 280 a 280 uh, word so this is very simple i think you already understand how you can execute this and when we click you can see the data so this is actually today's tutorial in next tutorial we will see admin routing and we will and uh, gradually we will see cacphp authentication 
So welcome for the next tutorial. Thank you for watching this tutorial.